name is Adri Kaiser with AdriKaiser.com. I want to share with you some of my favorite toys I use on a daily basis to help me sustain health and vitality. A few months ago, I suffered some injuries on my feet that led to stiffness and achiness on my back and neck. So I found these amazing tools that you can use anytime, anywhere at home to help you release some tension and tightness, especially from the tissue and muscles. I like to start seated. When you turn your head, you see this muscle over here. It's called the sternoscleidomastoid. They're one on each side, and they can get really tight, creating tension in your neck and even jawline. So grab this, uh, grab one of your balls, and you can turn your head and slowly begin to create gentle circles here. If you find a trigger point, make sure you, you can stay there for about seven seconds or so, but try not to stay there any much longer. You can roll down and up. You can uh, turn your head a little bit more or use the opposite hand to work these muscles over here as well, where you tend to have tension and tightness. You can take as long as you like. I just do it a little faster just for demonstration. Um, and then slowly find those areas where you're gonna be working on. When you move your head slightly forward when working on the computer or typing, you create more tension in your neck. Another way to use this is to have either two separate balls or I like this one that's just one together. It makes it much easier. And you can lay down and place the roller right under the base of your skull. And maybe move your head, like saying yes or no, turning your head from side to side. And watch the pressure. You are in control here. That's why I like to start seated, so you know how much pressure to put on your hand against your skin. And then slowly you can begin to move the roller a little lower and hold or whatever you feel that you need to hold. Again, it should be like it hurts, but it hurts good. Be mindful of how hard you're moving. And then just continue to roll a little bit more, so as the base of the, uh, the neck, maybe you, I like to also just lift my hips slightly and just rock my body forward and back. And you can do this for a few minutes if you like. And in the next video, I'll show you how to move down the spine. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day.